Welcome back to the land of magic. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba <laughs> ba oh, wait, hold on. No. No, not quite. Is it time? Is it for, close. Is it time for a, a, a Lego Jurassic Park? <laughs> would you would you play that? Well, you know, this is ostensibly the last Lego Harry Potter, right? I wouldn't be so sure. Because <laughs> this is this is the like so like they've exa exhausted like the movie tie-in games, right? Like yep. those are those are done, yep. uh, presumably. This kind of covers the end of the story for the this Lego this specific Lego sub franchise. It's true. Um, but I yeah, I, I guess never say never when it comes to. Uh, ring all that you can out of a license. But there are always more blocks to be stacked. I guess so. You know this. I mean, it's pretty impressive that uh, those, those Traveler's Tales guys... I'm going to see if I can jump in here. You should be able to jump in. Yep. We are, in fact, set up... Ron Striped Shirt. ...for you to play as Ron Striped Shirt. Yep. I'm going to play as Hermione and Jumper. Well, let's see here. What am I supposed to do here? Oh, dynamic right. split screen. So, crazy dynamic split screen. Still pretty cool. Supposed to use magic on stuff. Yeah, this is uh. So I didn't play the last one. No. The the last uh, Lego Harry Potter. Oh, just shot Harry Potter. Oh, don't do that. No wait, he's that's the not boy, Harry Potter. He's the boy who lived. That's some other dude. Uh, this seems like a well-made one, from what I've played of it so far. Check it out, Ghost uh, Ghost Studs. Are we uh, is translucent? Are we already already playing this? This is not a fresh. Uh, uh, yeah, this save is not. Here. This is not the very beginning of the okay, game. I okay. played through the tutorial level, so we are kind of out in it now. Got it. Uh, you want to give me a little tutorializing here, to so I know on, on the game. On, yeah, just kind of what my uh, basics are, because I don't know what the magic is. Yeah, yeah. Like you kind of shoot your wand as your basic attack. If you hold down X, you can move a target. Uh, yeah, yeah. Paint I stuff. I got there's, that. there's not that much you can shoot, but uh, there's a few things. Like that guy. Oh, okay, so you can actually paint multiple targets. Yeah, yeah. It's almost. Uh, it's not just almost like a... Panzer Dragoon style. Interesting. Uh, that, that was in there before. Um, there's a magic wheel, which I guess we don't have access to yet. But uh, let's run around London and cause some chaos. And yeah, it's got that, that dynamic split screen, which we saw previously in, uh, well, in previous LEGO games. Yeah, LEGO Jurassic Park, why not? I don't know. Yeah? I assume all of the, or I, I have assumed that all of these, uh, these LEGO games are based on existing, like, LEGO sets like it has to be a toy before it can be a game well i'm, I'm sure they would that be, makes sense i'm sure they'd be willing to fudge it for something sure, but sure. it seems like a lot of these uh yeah do exist as actual lego sets. Uh, you've already I mean, it's just wizards hanging out in this train I station i know it's such a land of enchantment hey what's up what's up ticket guy oh oh i found a thing he wants i found oh. a dude a muggle, muggle orphan what i want to play as the muggle orphan isn't that just an orphan i yeah, I guess so. <laughs> Did we really need to specify? Oh, probably not. Uh, Alright, this guy needs tickets, doesn't he? So you're not uh, you're not especially up to speed on the latter half of the Harry Potter mythos. Uh, no, and in fact, uh, you know, all of my Harry Potter uh, knowledge comes from the movies, mm. and I haven't seen, like, the last three, so... What is this? Is that a... Oh, man. Did you, did you find can't... a wheelchair? I don't know, but I can't... A go-kart? This thing's not working very well. Oh, it changed color when you got in it. I think it's flashing red because oh, it's, red, it's yeah. like... It's, I think it's about to break. Because it's bad. That's why it's red. I think it's stuck in that corner. <laughs> Get out of there. There we go. I see oh. some little uh, some little footprints over here by there this... There we go. By this little path here, I imagine. Sorry, oh, wait, buddy. hold on. Whoa. Oh, man. I got one of these, too. This is awesome. I don't even know what this game is, but this is pretty cool. Come back here. I ran over that judge. Must be a judge. Uh, so, uh, some foul, foul business is afoot in the world of Harry Potter at this point. Yeah, yeah, I, uh, yeah. I, 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 know if... I know that much. I know that everything's bad, yeah. and Hogwarts is all messed up, and it's not really about school anymore. Voldemort is back. Uh... Voldemort. I guess this is this is like just post Voldemort coming back, yeah, right? Yeah, that happens is... at the end of the the last uh, of, the last book before this. this. Yeah. yeah. Um, but we, we don't know what we're supposed to be doing here, do we? This guy needs tickets. Where do we get tickets? I don't know. Here's a ticket machine. I don't. Oh, that might help. Uh, so yeah, anything that's uh, anything that glows with that purple aura, you hold B. And oh, okay. It, it's, it's basically your force. Hey, of, there we go. It's it's how you build or use the force or whatever in this version. Got it. Uh, sweet. Um, so far, it's it's. Oh, what is that? It's a ghost piece. Let me get on the train. 
Okay. I guess we're going to school at this point. So uh, school is still in session here. Yes. And this is like. Well, so that's the, the kind of the crazy thing about where this this series goes is that like the powers that be in the wizarding world don't want to believe that Voldemort is back. Yeah. Like their their whole narrative is like you know we we vanquished him 20 years ago and everything is cool now, uh, or 15 years ago whatever. Uh, so he's like he's operating behind the scenes while the people who should be dealing with all of his nefarious stuff are kind of ignoring him. An uh, owl over there. And in fact, clamping down on uh, any unrest. Now I'm a pretty lady. What happened to Rod and Hermione? Who are you? I don't know. The blonde chick. Hit, hit Y. Oh, Luna you're Lovegood. Luna Lovegood. Who's that? She's a crazy girl. She is, uh... I've got magic. She's nuts. Everybody has magic. Uh, don't think you're special. To, to your knowledge, are there... Because I saw like what looked like footprints... Uh, for a, uh, a path that I couldn't, that, that none of us could take. Uh, so I assume that there are, like, non, just regular magic-using characters that you can play yeah, as. Yeah, there's all kinds of... Kind of... I played the, as... the, the usual class-based stuff yeah, that yeah, they totally. tend to throw into these LEGO games. Yeah, I played as Dudley in the beginning. It's weird. It's like, this has kind of become a, a subgenre unto itself. Yeah. So it's like, well, you're not even really judging this by, like... You know, typical game standards. It's more of just like, how does this? You know, what have they done to the Lego format right. for this latest one? And I guess you know, magic. Is, Not a lot. Yeah, yeah. This is they've got magic. Yeah, is what they did. But uh, I mean, they really streamlined it, though. I mean, like the the presentation is nice. The split screen works well. Uh, Follow that ghost. I, I feel like these games continue to get like subtly better looking over time. It's nothing. It's nothing super overt, you know. But they got a little motion blur in here. Yeah, and, this, and I mean, this seems at least as good looking as that last Star Wars game was. Yeah, yeah, that one was nice. The like Lego Pirates of the Caribbean was really nice. Mm. You know, I guess it still it, it still serves a purpose. There's still an audience for whom. I don't. I continue to find myself strangely fascinated by these games. <laughs> I don't know why is that. What? I don't know. And so far, this has not been real combat heavy. No, not so much. Uh, pretty early on. Yeah. Like I said. Well, let's get to some let's get to some wizard fights, oh, man. I can't get up there. Wizard duel. There's gotta be wizard dueling, a right? A little bit of wand dueling. Yeah, surely. I'm just gonna magic everything that I see that's got purple on it. Magic the shit out of this wagon wheel. Oh wait, I can just carry this thing around. I bet there's a reason for that. Hmm. No, it doesn't go up there. Hmm. Wait, what is this? Oh, here we go. Yeah. It was giving me a little marker to let me know, like, hey, this is where you want to put this. Yeah, they thing. had that. They had that stuff in Pirates as well. That stuff's super helpful because, like, as much as these games are for kids, like, there's so much kind of ridiculous trial and error you have to do. Well, the, it's the issue of, and I feel like we're kind of repeating conversation we had in the last. Uh, Lego quick look we <laughs> yeah, did that, together. That has not changed. Um, of just there are so many things to interact with that you can kind of lose the plot of weight. What's That's... the thing that I need to find? Like uh, now, now I'm just doing these systematically, you know, trying to interact with everything that I can, and hopefully one of those things will be the the, the critical thing. Which I bet makes this an amazing game to watch other people play. <laughs> hmm. I'm a magic you. Oh, that guy's glowing. I mean, I can manipulate him. You can. I'm doing it over here. Do my bidding. I, I bid you to fly around in the air in a circle. As you wish. He's totally doing it. Uh, hmm. Oh, there's oh. No, nope, I guess it's just... That's just whimsy. Plenty of that. Oh, for now. But shit's already gotten kind of dark, right? Like, like Cedric Diggory's already yeah, dead. Yeah, 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 So he's dead. Voldemort's back. He's rebuilding his power. Yeah. Uh, he, is in, think... he is in his Rafe Fiennes state now. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Uh, I think this is the one where uh, they basically declare kind of martial law at Hogwarts. They, they bring in some real hard asses to run things. Right. Uh, and it gets, uh, it does get pretty dark. 
like this uh, this real authoritarian lady they bring in to, to kind of take over the school. She uh, she gives people detention by basically like like cutting huge gashes into their hands and arms and stuff, and then just healing them up and doing it again. Ugh. That's uh, yeah. Yeah. Why don't you come up here? I feel like I need your help right. with this thing. I don't know if I can make this jump. No, yeah, you gotta run around. Engage split screen. Oh man, invisible wall! Come, come on. on. Uh, we try to shortcut it, Brad. Okay. Because I can only lift this thing up, hmm. and then it just does that. Might be something we need to put on the that thing. Oh, that would make sense. Man, we have to figure this out. <laughs> That's uh, Lego Harry Potter, yeah. years five through seven. Pretty sure the last Lego Harry Potter oh, here game. It is. Here we go. Aha. All right. There we go. Uh, okay. Is that the last one? Um, you already put the other one on, right? Yeah. Aha. There we go. I'll drive that thing right through that door. We did it. We did not get bested by Lego Harry Potter. <laughs> not yet. Yet. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's the thing we need another type of dude for. Yep. It's like a heavy dude that can pull those, nope, uh, those can't, orange handles. I can't open that handle. Well, there's that handle, and then there's this footprint thing over here as well. So there's some pets. Can dig up glowing patches of soil. Magic pets. carrots. Pets such as Crookshank's cat, by, by chance. All right. Let's look at the owl. Conduct the rest of this quick look in Lego talk. Huh? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. I'm just gonna say this does not really translate if you don't know the the core of what's going on here. <laughs> That's the bad lady. That is uh, oh, okay. what's her name? Laura's Umbridge, I think, is her name. It's a very Potteristic name to yeah, have. Yeah, there are a lot of good names in this series. Kingsley Shacklebolt there's, is a, there's, is a, there's a lot personal of, favorite of mine. There's a lot of, of onomatopoeia going yeah, on. Yeah, absolutely. Oh, uh, God, what's going on at this point? Oh, the C's having a bad dream about Voldemort killing Cedric Diggory, and then uh, clouding, and then Ron's all, you're a wizard, Harry. I'm a what? Here, kicking it Gryffindor style. What's your house, Brad? I'm a Hufflepuff. <laughs> Not really. I don't I th know. I think my girlfriend would be a Hufflepuff. Really? Yeah, pretty sure. There, <laughs> there was an attempt recently to sort of define the roles of the houses. Uh, most of them make sense, you know. Gryffindor is the good guys. Yeah. Slytherin is the bad guys. I think Ravenclaw is like the overachievers or whatever. And then. People had a hard time figuring out what the hell the point of Hufflepuff was. They're, they're the kind-hearted ones. They are the bumblers, I think. Luna, uh, Love, Luna Love Good is a, a Hufflepuff in spirit. If not, they're, they're kind of a bunch of flibberty gibbets. Yes. Yeah, they're sure. There you go. That's a, that's a very Harry Potter uh, word to use. Totally. Oh, wow. Oh, man, I'm burning. Oh. Turning around ghostly portraits. I'm gonna make him give me his uh, Lego pieces. Hey. Oh. Hey. Oh, the lady. Oh. Oh, I got another dude. Oh. Ginny. In her pajamas. That is untoward. <laughs> the British spelling, even. Yeah, is, is that in fact the official British spelling? Yep. I, guess, I guess it would be. Huh? Pajamas. Yep. What's going on here? The dude in this little mirror. Oh, magic dart. Oh, what do I do with that? You can shoot it around. Oh, man. Ah. Oh, you did it! Wow. Oh! Now you get Harry in his pajamas. Everybody is having a pajama party. We yeah, should... we're, we're here in the dorms, it makes sense. We oh! Should, we should have a pajama party. Oh, I gotta get those pajamas. How do I get. Oh, what is that? Who is that? That's somebody. That looks like maybe Hermione? I don't know. They kind of all look the same. Yeah. Like, when you don't have like extreme physical differences, i.e., uh, Star Wars. Yes. 
where it's crazy alien races. In this case, like it's a bunch of British people in gray shirts. Here's here is here is about fifty mop headed white people with British accents. Rather, tell them apart. Uh, I, I want to say those those ghostly arrows are new. Well, it seems like that's what's been pointing us kind yeah, of I mean, from. Yeah, that's, that's like the objective marker. Yeah. yeah but I, hey, let's uh, spend a moment over here uh, appreciating well, this Lego fire. Play, wow, that's actually kind of neat looking. That's a nice little touch. That's, yeah. I don't like the actual fire they have back there. No, in fact, in the fact, Lego fire. Why would you even put real fire in there? Yeah. What's up? When you, when you nailed sales. nailed the fake Lego fire so well. For real. Oh. Oh God. Jesus Christ. Dude, I, can't, I cannot even imagine what the production pipeline of Traveler's Tales looks like at this point. Like, what are they putting out, like, three of these a year? Seems like it, Or something. Right? It's oh. crazy. Yeah, Hermione, ball gown! Nice. I want to be that one. I want to be a pretty lady. We'll have to do that in between levels. All right. We got to get Follow out of here. Follow the arrow. Yep. I mean, we've, we've rung this dorm for all it's worth. We got to make something happen before this video's over. Hey, it's, uh, what's her name? Dolores Umbridge. Man, let's fight her. Oh, I need something. Be a different kind of dude, or... Hmm. So far, the most intriguing thing about this game is that it's called Years 5 through 7, uh -huh. and Harry Potter only, like, the series only goes to Year 7. Yeah. But there's a bunch of achievements in this for... Year 8? Complete so-and-so in Year 8. Yeah, oh, wow, really? I don't really? know what any of that stuff is. Hmm. I don't know if they just, like, made up a bunch of extra story for... Dude, I don't know. It's kind of weird, but... I don't know, but I'm over here magicking. Oh, can I get in there? You need to know Maybe dark magic to use the oh. dark magic objects. I bet she knows dark magic. I bet she does. Oh. oh what Whoa. was that? Hold on. What's that? Aha! Are you, are you vomiting? No, I was just doing push-ups, so now I'm super strong. Oh, I want to be super strong. Going down these stairs. Shoot this knight. Hey. Your magic feather. Whee! I'm going to throw her over the railing. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. That's a big old lock. I'm going through here. Okay. See, she's a big old meanie. She's against love. Yep. She hates it. I wonder if this is our hub. Look, these games always have like a hub that you come back to, right? Generally. Yeah. Yes. It's a that's kind of kind of an awfully big feature, awfully big area for it to be our hub, though. Do you know what's up with these uh, with these ghostly bits here? Those were in the first Lego Harry Potter, and I I don't remember. They do something. Oh man, the bookcase has a mouth. Actually, it's a wardrobe. All right. At least we made it to class. I'm gonna. I'm Is gonna this work. defense of the dark arts? Uh, maybe. I'm trying to remember who taught that it's one. Draco Malfoy. It's yeah, that guy's such a dick. I'm trying to remember who taught defense of the dark arts in this one. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> I want, I want what's inside of you, dinosaur. Whoa. Man, I'm speaking parts Oh, tongue. damn! I'm speaking snake language. It sounds like this. Snakes can't talk. That was my 
pull this thing. Uh, so far, decidedly less of a focus on combat yeah. than some of the other uh, Lego games. Yeah, I mean, which, which I guess you know makes sense for the source material. And sure, all. sure, but we'll know in the story later on it will be very combat heavy. Sure, because there's there's a whole lot of pointing wands at each other uh, later on in the Harry Potter uh, uh, narrative. Uh, but yeah, kind of a slow start. Uh, enough of a slow start that maybe that is a quick look at Harry Potter. Years, <laughs> what do you say? Yeah, I think you know. It's only so much you can show yeah. year over year with these things. Unless and, we uh, were to play through the whole thing and find some cool stuff. And I don't know that we we are familiar enough with the the intricacies of the series to say, oh, this is what has changed. Are there intricacies? I guess there's a few. Um, but it seems stuff. like they haven't broken it. No, so no, if it's... you still have interest in uh, you know Lego style games as well as Harry Potter, Harry uh, Potter. This, this doesn't seem uh, like egregious or anything, so... Harry Potter? Yes. Uh, before we go, I want to hear, now that this is over... Yeah. Uh, they, like, they've done all the Pirates movies, they've done as much Star Wars as they could possibly do. No, they can still keep doing Star Wars. You think? Dude, that show... Oh, right, they're that, still making new like they, episodes, The, the, aren't the they? new Star Wars grossly outweighs old Star Wars at this point. Yeah, you're and right. And the audience that watches that show is the same audience that would play a Lego game, Yeah, so. you're right. All right. So we'll, we'll expect more Star Wars stuff, but like most of these other properties, they've kind of rung dry. It seems like so it. So what, sure. what is what's your what is your like like dream Lego treatment? Oh, what do you what do you make a great Lego game with? Yeah, mm, that's a good question. Uh, given given the existing kind of brand synergy between WB and Lego, I am going to stick to Lego Mortal Kombat. <laughs> Although I know that's never ever going to happen. What would that even be? I don't know. It'd be a lot of heads popping off. Would, like it, just, little would, it, ju would it just be a fighting game? Imagine the Lego spinal cords. How great would that be? Will do. Uh, hmm. Lego, Lego. Uh, they, they already, you know, gave Lego Batman a shot. Yeah, that one didn't go so well, did it? Uh, yeah, I, I, I don't. It was okay. I played a little right. bit of it, but I remember it not being the the most well remembered of the Lego games. So. Uh, uh, I don't know. I'm more interested just to see like what, uh, yeah, what Traveler's Tales comes up with. I guess I, I don't have any particular properties that uh, that leap to mind. Like a Ro Robocop. But I have no doubts that they will keep them coming. So. I bet. I bet it will be a matter of months until we see one. We'll so. find out soon enough, Bradley. Yeah. So All that's right. uh, Lego Harry Potter years five through seven. Uh, we're playing the 360 version, but it's available for friggin' everything. Pretty much everything, yeah. Uh, so thanks, Brad. Yeah, thank you.